Hello there, this is Red Joy, and I wish you all a very, very happy Thanksgiving. Uh, I hope everybody traveled to where they needed to get to safely, or if you're at home, uh, that you're having a very safe and lovely holiday with your loved ones. Um, I decided I wanted to put together a really, really super long stream of Baldur's Gate 3. Um, you will probably notice that the first part of this is kind of edited a little bit for uh, speediness and kind of going through, quickly going through the kind of boring parts. Um, that's because the first time I recorded this, I messed up and I didn't actually have my microphone on. So um, so now this first part's gonna be a lot of commentary, but then the later part is going to be, um, is gonna be actually real time. Something's moving around in there. So we have the shipment that um, the dudes fighting the gnolls were supposed to deliver. And we know where they are. We know who is providing them. Or who it's for, rather. And so we're coming into... You spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Ooh, roasty toasty. Let's not be roasty toasty. Being roasty toasty is very bad. You definitely get that guidance up. Uh yeah. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna need to use whatever we can. <laughs> I do not want him blowing me up. Cause as much as I can bluff being a super badass sorcerer man, uh, I'm 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 not that special. Waiting on you. I like the sorcerer response a little more. It's kind of a badass response. The badass response deserves deserves a uh, advantage. Deserves that extra die. What's your business down here? I know, just walking in houses. I don't know. I'm sure Zaris won't turn down a deal. Down you go then. Entrance is hidden behind the wardrobe. Here's the key. I do like the tactic of having barrels of boom boom and lighting them on fire from afar. I might use that later on. That's far enough. What's your business down here? Answer honestly, and maybe we'll kill you clean. I've done detect thoughts before. It doesn't end well. Uh, kind of like the persuasion. Yeah, persuasion is the best way. Get some guidance on there. Twenty nine, and I just needed a ten. Your life was ours the moment you walked in here, but maybe I'll let you buy it back. I have it's precious that you think that's that's true. We disarmed the traps. Come down. All right, walk past all of the traps. Trying to find where Zaris is. Not many can talk their way into a Zenterim outpost. I could use some Zenterim. Interested in a job? I always thought that the Zenterim were like kind of like an organization of we mad scientists, right? right? Who would be like, we we're going to take Gibberling and combine it with a goblin, and then give it magic. See how that turns out. It's like, I don't think that that's a good idea at all. The Zen will relieve you of both. But today I'm offering work. Not looking for it. Kind of like the dark web. This is basically Zentarum are kind of the dark web. So is their cargo. Find them. Keep them alive if you can. Failing that, just bring that shipment back. Unopened. God damn it. Uh-oh. What about the shipment? 
What about the shipment? The shop is black bones. You did it. Yeah. Didn't open it. I'm Don't open it. No need to open it, right? Here's your coin. Yay! Money! Professionals are rare. You ever want more work? Come and see me in the gate. Our trader can the show gate. You some of our more exotic items now. But don't delay. I love exotic. This place items. is likely to be rubble soon. Someone kidnapped a duke right on our bloody doorstep. The flaming fist will need someone to blame. I don't plan on it. Yeah. Harold. That's a crossbow. Crossbow for Miss. Oh, I forgot. Shadowheart is nervous around wolves. Yep. I should speak up. Wouldn't linger down here if I were you. See all that smoke powder? The flaming fist won't find nothing here but rubble. Yeah, but they are the Flaming Fists, so, like, they probably don't know much better. Alright, at this point I'm trying to find where this merchant is. And I also don't want to piss off these guys. You don't want to keep Zaris waiting. Believe me. We didn't keep her waiting. We talked to her right away. You just didn't notice because you were too busy, I don't know, bashing your head on against... Boxes, whatever you guys do. Artist will make you a most heroic likeness. My pet artist. That's what. That's what the Pope's called, like Michelangelo. He's like, oh, my pet artist. He's gonna paint on my ceiling. He needs protection. However, the heck, the Pope's hot. I don't know. Costs, so much the better, eh? Of course. I don't want a portrait. Got some interesting stock for a friend of the family. Yay! Ma, get the trade with your stock. Uh, let's take a look at this stock. So a couple of general things that I'm looking for. First off, I got a shovel, which, thank God, I needed a shovel from somewhere. Um, general things I'm looking for. I'm looking for elixirs of strength because elixirs of strength are great. I think I purchased a dagger plus one. The expectation was to... Um, try to give it to Gale so that he could get rid of it but he's not going to take it because it's not magical enough for him which I guess makes sense like a magical item really is supposed to actually have magical properties to it and now we're going to check out the Underdark Mushrooms, crystals. Such depth to the shadows. Long ride down. I don't care what others say about the underdark. It's beautiful. The underdark. I've spent long. I mean, a dangerous place to it gets old, even for a zent. I mean, it is beautiful down here, but it's also like everything down here wants to kill you. Everything down here wants to cause you as much human pain as possible. Or inhuman pain as possible. Um, definitely don't know what that shaking was. It may have been the blasting rubble. So at this point, I'm like trying to figure out my way out of here. So I think the best course of action is just go straight to the treehouse. Just an insect. I'm sure you'll survive. Besides, it probably figured you for a tasty treat. You know, Shadowheart, that's really inconsiderate. Do you know how many people die of mosquito bites every single year? Millions. Okay, so here's the deal. These sheep, they're clearly monsters, right? Clearly like red caps. So I'm gonna kill one. Yeah. 
you blink, oh, by the way. Changes. The swamp, stinking and insidious, assaults your senses. By the way, the mice or rats that hang around uh, um, uh, Korka, is that her name? The, um, the psycho druid that wanted to kill uh, little girls. Yeah, she, um, those, those rats, they're shadow druids. Spoiler alert. Y'all knew that. I mean, like, come on. The game's been out for two months, Red Joy. I already know all the secrets of the game. You know who doesn't know everything? Shadow Heart, she misses. Yeah, red caps are funny. They're like they look like dwarf or look like like demented gnomes. What spell can I cast? Ah! Minor Illusion is one of those spells that uh is very um underrated. You never know how much like you need to have just distraction. Like a look over here option. It's the reason why I love summons in Baldur's Gate. Um, or D&D in general. Okay, tabletop D&D summons are a pain in the ass. Because it's like you have to manage this whole additional group. And if you don't have a GM or a player that knows how to actually do it, it's insane. And causes us all to want to... Um, Drown a sack of puppies, but the in video games where it's like it's like an automatic kind of control situation where you can control multiple ones at once, then it's not so bad. Kill him. Woot. All right. Loot their stuff. Now that just kind of look around, scout around. I tried to see if the back door, yeah, there's the back door, but can't really access it without looking inconspicuous. I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. I don't know what's happening with the sound here. And this pie is gonna come back up to say hello. One more bite. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating don't for make two. me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two. Isn't the cheekiest pop I'm not sure what's happening here. You best have one hell's of an apology for All me. sorts of weird stuff was happening with my recordings at this point, so. Like yeah, I'm ones. not apologizing. You know, I was gonna give you a swift kick up the arse and You're gonna give you me a door. kick up the arse. But that's that's precious. You and I could have a bit of fun the together. only reason why I would possibly be threatened by you would be if God, you're some sort of I don't know monstrosity witch hanging out in the woods that's I like seven feet tall and there's a whole bunch of cheating spells. Keep that hole under your nose shut. Or things will get messy. Hack doesn't tell us what to do. I actually like this. I like actually telling her what's actually happening. Like you you know, this witch that you've promised your uh your newborn child to totally just killed your brothers. Auntie Ethel. They were being rude. Honesty is the best policy, except for Asterian, who is a politician. Kind of. Is is that established did that get established that he is a politician? I don't know. She gets teleported away. At last. Some time in the cage should do her Love good. to know that spell. And you, Actually, it's. I mean, we kind of know that spell through waypoints. She transforms into a monstrosity. Oh, look at them pretty whites. You pretty lady, you. Okay, so natural thing to do. Trying to cause as much damage to her as possible before she flees. I can... Fireball. I knew there was a reason why I took that spell. 
and then I'll get up to the high ground and see if I can force her. In all honesty, I really shouldn't be worrying about her trying to attack me. I mean, like, she's just not going to cause that much damage. Well, she's not focused on damaging me. She's focused on... Uh, on... Um, trying to get away and trying to control the battlefield rather than actually do anything. But... Stupidly, I use this spell Spirit Guardians that doesn't do anything in this situation. I'm sure it would do stuff if I was actually, like, in the middle of a fight. But, you know, didn't actually use it right. I'm going to pause it real quick to check on my sound. Okay. I think that that worked. Aww. Pigs, children, and people with a Piper with a great. I love Carlac. She's more of what this country needs. Oh. You are as thick as they come, sweet. Oh my. This is my personal Oi. house, and you don't have a. You infant. pretty, pretty Get lady. Out. Oh my. Has that Wriggler eaten your brain already? Leave. Or you'll end up in tonight's stew. It'll go nicely with Marina. She's already marinating. Ah. You don't... No, that's just not right, okay? You marinate... Meat, right? You marinate the meat, so get it ready to put into the stew. Okay. Well, clearly I'm in a dangerous area, so I'm not traveling anywhere, which is just fine. What is this place? I came here for a purpose, and that is to kick ass and chew bubblegum. I'm all out of ass, so I just need some bubblegum. So I think the logic is... You feel crushing waves of fear as the presence within the door yeah. reveals. Yeah. It can't let people through, not again. Uh-oh. So images flash. A man cowering, a bag open at uh -oh. his feet. Gold coins spilling onto the floor. What did you do? His cries for mercy are cut short as the hag slices into him, dismembering him painstakingly, mm. limb by limb. She cackles. The man's remaining flesh twisted and contorted, becoming twisted surface of the door that sounds awesomely terrible Flee, you feel it cry a scene appears in your mind two paladins and a cleric marching yeah but the like that's, uh, in the glow they didn't have a rogue they didn't have an arcane caster they charge into what did they expect to do screams of terror pierce the air you let them in Nobody. That's a decade for each. You're mine for 30 more years, Petal. I love it. I think the hag is so awesome. Such an awesome design. So it's creepy. Age of blue skies and sunshine as the door shudders a warning. Run. It's form uh -oh. flickers. And you realize that the door is transparent. If I kill the hag. Thank God for bonuses. <laughs> you rolled a two? Yeah, but you're getting plus. You see the hag. You're getting plus 11. Walks through the door, its form shimmering. The lightest touch of hope brushes your mind as the presence within retreats. Mm. Give a character a little bit of psychic power. So, I had an idea. My idea was, I'd obviously put on the mask uh, with the spell uh, Protection of Good and Evil, right? That's the, uh, the, the, the right way to get, or one way to get through this area, right? 
But then I thought to myself, okay, but if I if I make it past the four masked individuals, then they're just gonna attack me when I attack the the hag. So my logic is, if I eliminate them, then I can actually prevent a fight, right? And I had an interesting way of doing that to try to show mercy, right? Which was, obviously, I put on the mask, do all that. Hello, Petal. My, my. The mask suits you. Just relax. See the world with friends. And what I do is... And let your dear right, one sec. Okay, so what I would do is cast... I Just like I did, I cast... Um, uh, protection from good and evil. And then I would cast that same spell... I'm going to actually cast it on the paladin lady that's down here um, and use that to try to break, have her break free, right? Uh, because if she can break free, she's the most rational of them. She can take off the mask and help us fight. Must think I'm one of them. This sounds like a clever idea. I'd rather not. All right, let's see. Unfortunately, it takes my protection off, so then I want to take off the mask, and then it activates all these characters, and if I'm all by my lonesome, it kicks the crap out of me, and it breaks my concentration, so the original plan failed. So, that strategy doesn't quite work. So, Strategy two, grab masks for everybody and then cast to sneak them past. Which my logic is, is then in that case, then I can maybe fight them afterwards or whatever, right? Or maybe put them into a good enough position so that we'll just lay the smack down on, on the goons, on, on the masked guys. Um... Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Stop. Yeah, if we put the... Make our way through... Maybe cast protection from good and evil on one of them, right? That was... My second thought, but then I realized I'd be in exactly the same spot. So... Don't. Option three... Don't. Kick down the front door. Very, very and by kick down the front door, I mean sneak up to it and... Do some sneaky stuff. Let's get going. Yeah, I'm gonna fight these guys. In fact, I think when I played this, I, I thought to myself, "Mercy is for the weak." Ooh. I still have not had that dialogue open up for him. I think it's because I haven't found the pig. The pig that was drained. So, I need to do that. I need to figure out where that pig is. Yep. Try to sneak attack on one of these. Yeah. Okay, so she's moving past there. Uh-oh. So initiative. Well, at least I got a good hit on that one. And... Starion... Okay, so he failed his stealth. So they targeted him. And he's frightened, unfortunately. Alright. So the key thing is just... For me, if I can just hop up here and then start peppering one of them. Yeah, if I can take her out. Okay, I took one out. I think the thing that's made today very, very successful combat-wise is adhering to a principle that I try to adhere to when I actually play the game, which is focus fire on one target, hit that one target, knock them out, um, or incapacitate them or whatever, right? Um, 
before um, before um, trying to go boogie before uh, trying to go onto another target right the logic is is that if I can drain the action economy then um, uh, then I end up getting more powerful. I'm gonna target the Paladin next. Yeah. No, I don't need. Having forcing her to come up is a good idea. I got lucky with that save. And she can actually jump up. That's good. Yeah. Get yeah, burn her down. I'm getting real sick and tired of you throwing poisons. Can she fire? Yes. And... Shazam! I swear, a really nice ability I picked up was, uh... Uh, that, um, the cantrip, the, uh, arcane cantrip. Yeah, very, very good call. All right, so we pass these. Heavy stone, try to have, get through these. Trying to have him get through. Trying to figure out also my pathing. There you go. Did that work? Okay, avoid that flower at the bottom. Nobody seems to detect it. Grab the stone. Everybody can make it past there. Okay, so now we're basically safe past all the Noxus fumes. And we get to Marina. Now it's go time. You come to my home, interfere in my business, and now have the gall to face me in the heart of my lair, you petulant bollocks. I'll rip your spine out your asshole. I'll use your blood to spice my stew. I'll keep you alive until I've sucked the marrow from you. That sounds bones. awesome. Lee, terrible. I'll bring you back and do it all over again. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie. At this point, this fight was infuriating, and I'll tell you why. So, logic was, throw water on the cage, right? If I throw water on the cage, these, the, I, I managed to survive. Um, if I throw water on the cage, then it stops the, stops the, um, stops the fire, right? Sounds easy enough. Here's the problem. Every single time I try to activate the water, um, you know, trying to get this all situated, right? Give everybody water so they can all have a chance to throw it. Every time I try doing that, I, I, it, it cancels out my action. Every time I touch the water bottle, it cancels out my actions. It was really annoying, right? So magic missile, clear out the illusions. Okay, so Asterion and Zeno, it made sense because they used their action. That's fine, but but now she had an action, but suddenly loses her action. So much as activating the water caused her to lose her action. I have no idea why. No idea why it was infuriating when I was trying to trying to get it. I I seriously thought Miriam's totally gonna be die. She's totally gonna die. 
Yeah. I just lost my action. Just by touching the water, I lost my action. Like how... I, I, and I don't know why that happened. It's really, really weird. Okay. I love, of course, super jumps. Marina, of course, is freaking out. So I think the next best course of action, try to, oh, Xeno goes down. Yeah, why not? Try to see if I can, oh, ow, attack of opportunity and burning. Yeah, see, I, I lost, of course, lost the action there. Really irritating, I was seriously thinking she's gonna die. Okay, get rid of. Yeah, let's rage. IRL, I was totally raging too. Yeah. Let's see here. Okay, so, yeah, she teleports Mayrina out. So I activate non-lethal attacks. Because I don't know if I'm going to hit her or if I'm hitting... Yep. Happy that I did that. And also happy that I moved myself out of the way for the hag to actually hit me. Heal up. Always a good idea. Ugh. Ah, finally! Guiding Bolt actually hits! Nicely done. Oh, jeez. Alright, magic missile time again. Alright. And then fly a little bit. Backstab. I think she's the only target there. Yep. All right, last one. I I knew she was there, but of course can't really target her because she's invisible. All right. Just do as much damage as possible. That's good enough. And I am aware I lost the opportunity of getting the um, ability score improvement, but what are you going to do, right? I'll have other opportunities to get really big boosts. If not over. This is silly. I want Xeno to be the one to talk to her. But Shadow Heart's going to be the one with her charisma of eight. She was going to bring him back. Bring on her back. I have a thought on Shadowheart. And this is actually... I'll, I'll share it after this dialogue. I promised to raise the child. Teach them magic. Give them a good life. It's a damn sight better than I can do. I just wanted everything back. back the way yeah, you and America was. both. It's my own letting her look I don't like owing people here this socket is worth some coin naturally I gotta go with what Shadowheart would actually say I mean it would be silly to just look after it <coughs> My husband yeah it I'll look me. after it right until I can sell it what I should take him home his coffin is just upstairs. A decent burial is the least I can give him. That is Thank literally you. the least you can give him. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone else who would have saved me. 
Okay, so here's my thought on Shadowheart, right? She has Charisma of 8. By the way, awesome, awesome stuff. Very happy I got a ton of great potions and materials from old hag. Um, but, and of course all this lovely items here. But Shadowheart has a Charisma of 8, right? The thing is, is that she is good at deception. So she's good at faking being charismatic and understanding and sympathetic and all that she's not really or is that just part of charisma naturally found the wand what you can here you go you feel a Ooh. surge of power from the wand. The air suddenly tastes acrid. It wants to yeah. be used. Bring it back. Bring Connor back. Magic Please. time. Abracadabra. Oh God. Oh God. Feel something pull at you. The creature yearns for a master. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you a United States Senator. What have you done to him? Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. <laughs> okay, so moral choice. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna give her back her husband. At least she can help out with the wheelbarrow. Connor? Push things Connor? around. She already lost her brothers. At least this can give a little bit of hope. But he might be. And if he is, I'll find him. You go, girl. Here's the wand. Thanks. But we'll need more than luck. A bloody miracle more like it. I'll find a wizard or something. Maybe someone in Baldur's Gate can help us. Connor always said you can find anything in that city. <sighs> and thank you. Closure! Come on, love. Let's go. Fella Buster! <laughs> okay, enough. Enough. <laughs> uh, the easiest lock in the world. We open it and get a ton of great stuff. Yeah. I think this is about as good as we could have gotten. Who is M? Forces work in Boulder's Gate. The mewling wretches are trying to edge me out of my territory. Uh oh. Why would a hag be interested in what's going on in Baldur's Gate? I don't know. What I do know is I want to go under here and chat with the poor sods down here. Oh, oh, my head. oh no. No. Why ain't I petrified? Um, uh, well. What? How? How am I still breathing? I have the bite. The bite. I wouldn't wish it on anyone. Your insides end up on the <laughs> outside. Petrification stops the spread. I was on death's door. But now I feel... I feel great. I feel good. Na 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 na. I knew that I would. I'm gonna fail this roll. And I don't even care. Because I'm not a physician. Do I want to bother? No. You can't detect anything. You have no explanation for his good health. I suppose I should count my blessings. 
Most ain't so lucky. I don't fancy hanging around here, but thank you. Not sure what the bite is, and but it sounds bad. Gold necklace. What's astonishing is like a gold necklace or gold ring in our world can be very, very expensive. But like in this world, it's like, Seems like a good moment. relatively low wealth. God. God. Or relatively low cost, rather. Oh, That's please. what I meant. They burn in the nine hells. The hag. There's never been a more vile creature. <laughs> you remember me? <laughs> really? I was a fool. I wanted to know my fate. I had a choice between two lives, and I was frightened of choosing wrong. I asked the hag to help me see what the future would hold. Got what I wished for, too. I saw my future self. A corpse. Rotten with maggots. And everyone around me dead. Putrid and dead. Ugh. A boring story. Stay or go. Marriage and kids or a life of novelty. I lost my best years rather than just uh, choose. It's like freshman year of college. Yes. I will. And then again, Thank dude, you're an elf. Like, when your best year is going to be spent doing? Frolicking in the woods and being beautiful? Alright. So... Rest, short rest. We'll go up and go back up to the um, try to gather all this stuff. Get the poisoned apples. I have a feeling like we're gonna have to uh, snow white somebody. Is that a proper term? I don't think that's a proper term. What I mean is. Give somebody a poisoned apple and then cackle as they eat it and die. Or rather, enter a state of near death. Okay. Well, doesn't seem like they're attacking, which is nice. Just gather all the stuff. Okay. So at this point. From an overgrowth of moss, the well looks unremarkable. Yeah. Gonna investigate. And by the way, narrator, that's ivy. Ivy is growing on the on the well. At this point, the commentator would come out and say, well, technically, it can be both ivy and moss. You just can't see the moss. To which my response would be, there's far too much sunlight on that well for there to be moss to grow on it. Touch the webs. I'd hate to disturb the locals. Webs. Jump, hop, skip, jump. And Mortal Kombat. Ouch. See, I feel like at this level, it's a challenge, but it's not crazy difficult, right? Like, Asterion is half health after just two hits. But at least he had a chance to hit. At least he has a chance to react and do stuff. Versus what I was running into before, where it was, up. Oh, guess they cast a web or whole person on you. Mm, guess you're not doing much. Take him out. Let's see here. Yeah, there you go. It's like, you better hit. Over there. Nice. Double spider. Spiders don't like fire. After all, 
Fire beats bug type. Pokemon! <laughs> oh, come on. Trying to find my best route. Huh, so when I use fire on something that's infected, it cures the infection. Nice. Something else that cures an infection is a giant sword going straight through your body. No, not as bad as it could have. That'll cure an infection real quick. It's like, no, it doesn't, Red Joy. It kills people. All right. Who wants to talk to me? Moving in. Somebody want to talk to me? I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody who wants to talk to me. Oh. Oh, Gail. We have to give something else up, on I? My condition is worsening again. I need to consume some powerful magic or... I swear to God, this better pay off. Better get, like, a huge amount of experience points or... Something really cool happening. Yeah, getting rid of these. Thank you. It is a strange experience. Each time a new I can't. Lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. Somehow the second artifact hasn't had the effect of the first. It somewhat relieved the discomfort, but I fear my hunger hasn't quite... Uh. So, Water Davian has hunger issues. The magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time, like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire drizzles the embers still sizzle the fire remains she's that's called heartburn so dude on, take some good. nexoderm cq and call me in the morning dumbass to retrace my steps to a glade of calm. i'm sorry gail is a fine character i just never take him with me and i for the artifact water davians wanted to make me drive my head to a wall a great deal of trouble indeed All right, we're gonna rest. Uh oh, it's these three, which means devilish shenanigans. Hellsfire. She's coming. And hell's fire, literally. Well, you've been naughty, and you know what happens when mm. you're naughty. God damn it. Anyone but her. <laughs> Everybody has the reaction of, of oh my god, it's her. It's her. And then you know, every dude is like, boobas. Your hair is pretty. Out of the bag. Call me Mazora. I'm Will's patron. The fount of yeah. his power. And? My pet's been unruly, and his leash needs a yank. Ouch. We had a deal, Will. But Carlite's still breathing. I've taken more pleasant shits than you, Mizora, and at least those can be buried after. That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Carlite, Zariel sends her regards. You told me, devils only. She's a tiefling. We are still in the Phase Spider oh, Cave. Precious. Probably want to like keep quiet, because that mage shark's probably like, what the hell are those humans rambling about? Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. 
Karlak meets the criteria by virtue of having wop, wop. a heart. Don't you worry. That ship has long sailed the sticks. But a defiant pup must still pay his price. Ah. Oil burns in the fires of Avernus. The lightning storms of Dis strike his Fire flesh. is bad for you. His soul passes through each layer of the hells, gaining their essence Ouch. and their torment. That. Oh. Well, I will say the horns aren't a bad touch. That's better. What the hells have you done? The promise broken. Okay. To be fair, though, like. You know it's not like it's that big of a deal. I mean, like, this is a magical world. I wouldn't bat an eyelash if, like, some spider spider centaur thing walked in and said, Hello, I'm going to be the new sheriff of your town. Do, 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 do. Keep an eye on him, would you? I'll be keeping mine on you. On me? Oh, and Will, don't forget. Our pack still oh. stands. That sounds bad. It can't be a bad. Well, Will, I'm sure you have some stuff that you'd like to tell me about. God's damn her straight back to the hells. Just look at me. I did what was right, and Mazora made me pay for it. I'd be hunting devils and demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites, heartless evils of all sorts, but not... Not Zariel's victims. Not innocent tieflings. Warlock packs tend to be unforgiving from what you know of them. Will was lucky he didn't face a more severe well, punishment. What did you expect? She's a devil. Hardly a paragon for honesty. Yeah. I feel like with Will, I can, like, keep it real. They're like, dude, you're being an idiot. He's like, well, I might be being an idiot. But here was my logic with it. Mm, you're still kind of an idiot. Well, I guess you're right. That's like, kind of like every time I hear him talk, I'm like reasonable. I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds. But I promise you, every thrust of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. Sure. Yeah. The one little question that put me out of house and home. I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. I can tell you most all else, but the pact mm. I'm forbidden, unless Mazora permits it. But I'll say this. The moment I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for mm. a heartbeat. It was my proudest deed. It was worth the sacrifice. All I can give you on that is my solemn word. Okay, we'll chat with Will. I'll be honest, soldier. Carlac. I'm reeling. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life over his. <sighs> Been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. I mean, are you that surprised, Carlac? You are. You can say that again. Like you're dealing with a dude who basically wishes he was a paladin. He was just another sad merc. How wrong I was. Or kind of wishes he was like a quasi Robin Hood, Errol Flynn gentleman. Ooh, what do we got here? It's a dream! A dream! Wakey, wakey. I promised I'd be back. Don't worry. I have things under control. For now. I see you've been using the powers the tadpole gives you. Good. But things haven't gone as you nope. expected. You thought Natty might be able to help you in the Druid's Grove. But all she did was reaffirm... And Wyvern Poison. 
Right, wyvern poison. Remember to take the wyvern poison. Understandable. Jesus, game, calm down with your damn wyvern poison. So what should I be doing? Your parasite is unusual. It is wrapped in magic that prevents its removal. Until the source of the tadpole's magic is destroyed, any attempt to remove it will kill Oops. you. The parasites are merely a symptom of a greater sickness in Faerun. Hmm. There's a sickness. A sickness in Faerun. The absolute sames are not yet clear to me, but its progress towards domination is clear. But These what is are more than a lithid spawn? They are vessels for control. Hmm. The infected hear the voice of the absolute and believe it to be a god. That is how the cult of the absolute is spreading. The highest of their rank, the true souls, carry a tadpole just like yours. It is how they receive their orders, it is what makes them. Obey. When the order to transform is given, it will not be a matter of days. They will be mind flayers Oops. in an instant. Were it not for my protection, so would you. Okay, but like, there's other true souls out there that haven't turned it's into mind flayers. But I'm an adventurer, just oh, like you. Really? Just like you, I was infected with a mind flayer parasite. Just like you. I seek to be free of it. I've been trying to escape from this evil for a long time. Once, I almost succeeded. Now, through you, I've been given a new chance. You can go where I cannot, and I can protect you mm. from that evil. If we work together, we may turn this around. Hells, they need me. Don't know who they is. That's the pronoun game. No. It isn't safe. The power I used to protect you, I stole it from someone. Okay. They want it back. I will hold them off for as long as I can, but sooner or later I will yeah. calm down. A cup of coffee might do you some good, sweetie. The source of the magic that controls the parasites before that happens. Maybe Snickers. Follow the cultists' trail. They will lead you to their masters. Use the powers your parasite gives you to convince them you are one of them. And when you find the source of their magic, dun dun dun. It. Go. Our freedom depends on it. Okay. So, at this point, uh, this is the point where I. Uh, take a break uh, from the game and this is a point where I have the new voiceover takeover I'll have a little introduction there and so so yeah so I'm going to be right back it'll be probably exactly the same for you guys so just one second and we're back I actually had to uh, leave do a little bit of editing. Turns out that when you uh, when you forget to turn on your microphone, you gotta end up doing editing. So this is at the point now where we are actually recording fully live. But the good news is that the um, previous stuff should be easy to fix up, which I'm pretty sure I already did, which you already saw. So. Without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to make our way out. We're going to leave camp and we're going to take care of the rest of those spiders. Let's see here. Okay. So, um, uh, 
Alchemist Fire. Why not take all? Ooh. Frantic urgency during gain momentum. Okay. Once you lose, what, 50%, is it said? So, during combat, when the wearer starts their turn with 50% HP or less, they gain momentum for one turn. Well, I feel like that's something that's really good for... Um, uh, wait, can she wear it? I feel like, uh, I feel like Carlac would be pretty good to wear it. I'm not quite sure what momentum does. Let me see here. What is momentum? During comp, no. Momentum, spurned on, increased. Actually, that would be good for me. Because. Because I tend to need uh, ranged abilities. What is this way? Oh, that's another way out. Okay. Nope. I want to take care of them spotters. Spotters. That's a dead goblin. Matriarch is right around here. it's saving it's just me or does it feel like it's saving at better points now right like no time to rest I just feel like it's it's saving at better points now everybody together um, if I could force them to teleport let's get going hope your soul is in good hands ow Ah, crap. Thank God I have Fireball. Let's see here. 
Oh, I just thought of something very, very, very funny. Okay. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Uh Let's go. Carlac. Soldier. Okay, now, hopefully, this will let me do it. Let's see, where is my... <sighs> Let's see here. Smoke powder. I thought I had two of these. It needs to be ignited, right? Another fight. Let's go. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Boom. Yeah, son. That's how you do it. Oh, you're still alive. Well, okay. I guess we're inclined to make silly choices. Oh, thank goodness. This is good. Uh, let's see. Now they see me. Dang it. Ready for another round. Eh, might as well. Ow. Gosh, wouldn't it be just a shame if something happened to this spider web? Not much more I can do. Okay, she's got to take him out. Oh my gosh, wow. That's tough, tough spider lady. I won't give in. It's all because it wants me to handle all this. Three projectiles? Let's make it four. Because.
Let's turn someone inside out. I got this. Knees high. Goodbye. All right. Very successful. Breathe deep and move. That was all the space fighters. Um, uh, what's it called? Positioning. Because that was really silly of it to get to a spot where it was going to die nice and easy. Dark Amethyst. Oh. Whatever comes, I'm ready. Stop. Stop going towards the edge. Just stop it. I don't think he would actually fall, but what like gods are watching me. What's inside? Let's see here. There was something else down here too. Ah, that's what I was looking for. Nice. Okay, I'm making myself dizzy by all this spinning around. Cragged rock. What is this? Sorry. And what's this way? I think that's a skeleton I already checked on. Okay. And there's stuff back this way that I need to... to go back and grab. <laughs> Roasty toasty. Dead goblin child. Then I think there's stuff. Anything of use? A bone. Ooh. All right. Water. Water is wet. Unless. No, it's almost always wet.
fringe philosophy. I'll pass on that. Spider step boots. Could have been useful, but you know. Firebolt. Scroll of Misty Step. Nice. So I don't have to burn a spell slot. That's good. Elixir of Fire Resistance. A dagger. Potion of healing. Alright, I split up my potions of healing as well. I do not care about a loot. Sorry, I just don't. Yeah, this way, up this way. Brings me to another part of the old place. I can't move. What boots am I wearing? There we go. It's only me, the heavy footed moron, who can't walk his way through. Ta ta. Trust no one. Let's move. Hmm. Light on my feet. Do I break through that wall? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Resistance to slashing immunity, piercing damage. Still breathing, despite everything. Gosh, it's almost like I have something that could break through that. Don't waste a step. Ow! Right when I said no traps, please. What is there? A trap. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Oh, she's too far away. Can't give up now. 
Ooh. Steel forged sword and infernal iron. Infernal metal. That's what my engine's made of. Hang on to that. All is out. Guys, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Stop going up there. I meant to push this button. Okay, so hopefully I'm not going to regret opening this door. I am going to save my game. And we'll see if I indeed am going to regret opening this door, which, you know, you never know. Ya never know. It doesn't seem like the goblins mind me being here. Do a quick short rest. Oh, put the wind back in my sails. All right, so I got these ogres here. I'm kind of thinking they have something that's actually very powerful. I'm kind of thinking about having it. Kind of want it. Let's see. Here we go. Tastes like chicken. No chicken. Tastes like fish. Gentlemen, contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. And what surprise is this? Lump the Enlightened. Brothers, look here. I have eyed yet another prize. Fortune favors our bellies. Stranger, be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show us the brand of the absolute. Am I not astonishing? <laughs> a robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I am a gourmet. And you, a delicacy. Unless you bear the mark, of course. Food? Food? All right. How much HP do these guys have? Um, let's have a little fun.
let's see here. If I were to throw it, oh, that's an action. Never mind. The only way out is through. to find a way forward yeah keep out of sight for him but Why did I do that? I meant for her to to have a shove. Yeah. How much HP do you have? Crap. Well, well. Look what we have. as well. Let's quicken the spell. Which HP do you have left? That did not do much. Ow. Stupid wizard.
tactical. Yes, here. Time for a new. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Disadvantaged. Yeah, if he's gonna roll one. Nothing important is ever easy. Yeah, I'm gonna make it critical. Okay. What path lies before me? Oh. Got to keep fighting. On I go. All right, now. Excuse me. Why can't you cast a spell? I can at least reduce it, and this time it actually missed, so that's good. You are so screwed. Wow, a huge amount of damage. What now? Into the bloody fray. Goodbye. No time to dally. Onward. All right, let's see here. The real prize is Warped Band of Intellect. Sets the wearer's intelligence to 17. Hells yeah. And then Lumps Warhorn, I don't care about that. Yeah, son. I'm still encumbered, right? Yeah. Okay, we can send some stuff to camp. Let's see here. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Wait a second. Oh, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, come on, mouse. Uh. No, wrong. Okay, what is going on with this mouse? Come on, wake up. Maybe. Send to a stern. There we go. Nice bonus to his enchantment, to his uh, abilities. Am I still encumbered? I don't think I am.
There we go. Look at the big brains on Zeno. Awesomest fight ever. What you morons have. Whole chicken. And you think had a single gold. Everything seems to be at the point where it will encumber me. So, um, Really? I use a shovel. Only this can seem to sort. Nothing but dirt. No use digging here. Nothing interesting buried here. No use digging here. There we go. Weird. All right. Well, would you look at that? Ah, here we go. Okay, what is going on with this mouse? Hope you twits don't mind if we killed your friends. The big ones. Uh, wait, am I going the right way? I don't think I am. Nope, I am not going the right way. I'm going exactly the opposite of the right way. See, at this point of the game, I actually feel like I am uh, competent. Just a brief respite. Okay. Saving, that's good. Is there something over here? War drum. One of those can summon fighters far and wide. Okay. 
Let's have a conversation with these Joes. Look it, Claw. Sapper's here. Unless you've got another reason to be here. Feck sight. Yeah, that's not very nice. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Don't need to use it just yet. I win. I am more important than you are. The game is called Baldur's Gate, not Dipshit Goblin Guard. Guess we're in with all sorts these days. If you're here to see Draw Ragslin, you'll want to let him and the lads know you're one of us. There's a party on. Celebrating a raid, we are. You'll need to wear our war colors. Nice to have this across the mug. Oh, to do it. Oh, why the frick not? Wait, 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 wait. I might regret doing that, but you know what? It'll be funny. Yeah, it's not the wisest decision. It was not what I wanted. I'm sorry, guys. That was funny, but no. No, we're not going to do it that way. <laughs> No, we're gonna we're gonna actually talk our way in. It's thinking. What's for this mouse? There we go. Seems to be working now. There we go. What path lies before me? Look it, Claw. Sapper's here. Unless you've got another reason to be here, feck sight. You know, the cockney is strong with you. Power courses through you. Authority. Oh, jeez. Uh, this should pass. Yeah. Damn, Claw, back up! She's a little overexcited. It's been a busy day. The lads are celebrating. Who? If he ain't one of us, and if he's here, he's down in the pits. The pits? He couldn't be somewhere pleasant sounding, could he? Better still be alive. Heh. Depends who you are. We're celebrating a raid. No better time in camp than this. Get yourself a bit of fun before it dries up. Rip the guts out of Joaquin's rest, we did. Mm-hmm. Inns are good for gutting. Yeah, I saw your handiwork. It's even captured some duke. Worth celebrating, that is. Couldn't guard his nose from his fingers. Ain't fair. Yeah, let's try not to anger anybody else now that we're in the camp.
So yeah, we want to make sure we get to get ourselves to the. Uh, Sounds like they captured themselves a bard. Figure out what he or be you be headed. Goblin kind will tease you and frap with fragulous crown and with scepter a braid. Draw Ragslin, short work of the innkeeper made. The inn burnt to ash. The captives were many. Goblin kind had reduced them to cowering Filfenny. So raise it. Filfenny, that's not a word. Drain them with pride. Draw Ragslin, the true soul, had led you collide. <laughs> Give him my rapt attention. You, move off! Do as she says. Now. <clears throat> uh, now, where was I? Huh? Wait a tick. That a friend of yours? Oh, certainly not. What are you doing? I'm busy here. You lying? To you? Never. Come, let's continue our ballad. <clears throat> uh, draw Ragslin. Uh, draw Ragslin. Um, uh, uh, um, uh, I am a draw Ragslin. Um, um, come choose a uh, uh, draw Ragslin. Uh, um, you broke him. Wait, wait. Uh, draw Ragslin. We pray. We uh, come on, pigeon. Back to your cage. Now, look what you've done. Come on. Of course, my name's Gribbo, idiot! Right, yes. Not for me. Hmm. Now how to get inside. Wondering where the drinks are. Because once I get those drinks, once I figure out where the drinks are, what's up for discussion? You look like you got something jingling in your pocket. Looking to spend it? Yes. Why, yes, I am. Yes, I am. Let me use this out. Thought that was an ingredient. Returning pike. Oh, that's kind of neat. Doom hammer. Great club. Great sword. Okay, I can sell some some Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Any other gems? Just wondering if there's anything else I want to sell. Did I just sell all of the stuff? Wow, I am a dumbass. That wasn't at all what I wanted to do. Okay, well, I mean... Yeah, that was not at all what I wanted to do. Okay, relax, relax, relax. Okay, no harm done. Yeah, okay. Come on, scroll up. There you go. Okay. Last thing I want to do is split these items. I will keep This might be useful.
Okay. Let's go ahead and head back to camp. Anyone need to talk to me? No? Okay. Oh, it didn't even get rid of all my supplies. Okay, that's not bad. Right. Ooh. You can't chase the thoughts of that poor girl you killed from your head. You wonder what she looked like as she died. Squirming, skewered in abject agony. Let's take a walk. Your body barely complies. You feel such rushes from your thoughts of the dead woman. Why did she die? The mystery gnaws at your pounding heart. Ew. My lord, jubilant day. I have found your vile self at last. Skeleritas fell. Your loyal and ever adoring butler. I followed you, my dear rotted master. We have been parted so tragically long. Oh my. heard of my lord's indisposition uh, but I'd hoped the rumors were untrue oh my no matter we will get you back to committing five villainous acts before breakfast in no time I found you following the stench of that bard <sighs> she reeked across the coast like a piece of Dog mark on the road. Such fine work could never be done by a wretch like me. Anyways, I come once again bearing a part of your dreadful inheritance. You earned this iniquitous prize through your great show of exceptional violence the other night. I'm sure Master will be better soon. A fellow of your fine breeding is never down for long. <laughs> I cannot wait until your next act of shameless barbarity. Though I would love to regale you with your past triumphs, uh, I cannot. I am forbidden to interfere. Our uh, betters will not allow it. Be true to yourself, my lord. Be true to myself. Deathstalker's mantle. What is the Deathstalker's mantle?
Once per turn, when you kill an enemy. So, let me put this on, see. Hmm. Invisible for two. Yeah, actually, that is incredibly useful. I don't like the way that cloaks look. Dog pants through a ball held firmly in his mouth. Oh, I'm going to throw the dog at the... <laughs> Give it a half-hearted try. No. Jeez. Sorry, best buddy, I didn't mean to, uh... Try again. Get a one, get a one! Yeah, I have a better chance with this. It's like two ones in a row, two sevens in a row. Like I want to definitely do it. I'm happy that the game has given me lots of chances. I'm not going to use a bonus. No, I'm not using a bonus. Might need to see what the bonuses are. Nor am I using inspiration. That's silly. What are these bonuses? No. Wait, that is... That's a cantrip. Relinquishes the ball. It is well chewed and slick with drool. Yummy. His eyes track the ball avidly. He shuffles on his paws, ready to chase after it. When did I throw the ball? Scratch's tongue lolls out happily, his tail wagging even faster. I think I can throw the ball. Your heaviest ball I've ever seen. <laughs> the best boy in the realms. I freaking love it. Uh, anybody else need to talk to me? No, neato. Okay. I think the way I was able to get in earlier was convince this gal. 
skills, guts. No doubt, mate. But this ain't dragons or demons or anything else you might. Or dungeons? You dungeons? Dungeons and dragons? Chicken chasing. I want a beholder. Only the greatest game since eggs sprouted legs, mate. You just gotta chase the chicken round the course and through the posts. But that ain't all. Gotta do it quick and alone. Any of your mates step in, you lose. Time runs out, you lose. Sound easy? It ain't. Better contenders than you have been bested by the bird. <laughs> Fancy yourself, do you? Care to pin that claim down with some coin? Then you don't want to play. This game ain't for rattle guts that don't believe in their selves. We got the coin. We got the challenger. Now we just need the crowd. Okay. Let me see here. Where is That's good enough. <laughs> yes. Bite and claw and tear and bite. Anyone who's ever like seen a chicken knows that they're nothing to be screwed around with. Okay, this should do it. There we go. Right. Well, you ain't the first foreign type, I suppose. What are you calling foreign? I'm American. Americans are foreign anywhere. <laughs> Understatement, but yes, let's not linger in this place any more than necessary. Uh, that will be some real fun. <laughs> Keep my guidance up. 
Not like it can't recast it, but it's like, you know. Yeah. Hold out your arms oh my. So I can mark your flesh. Okay. Let's the faithful recognize one another quick sharp. That way nobody'll mess with you. And it's charged with magic. Ordinary slobs can't see it. Only us that follow the absolute. You ready? Brace yourself, this'll sting. Hmm. Definitely not doing the hold out your hand. I've always wanted to smell my own burning flesh. I feel like this is the one. I'm trying to get her into the back room, so. Hold still. Nope. Not what I wanted. The pain muddles you. Nope. What I wanted was I wanted to get her into the back room. I think I had to do the not going through with it. I know, I know, it's safe coming, but you know what? You're gonna have to deal with it. You ready? Brace yourself. Maybe you don't need it. After all, you're okay. special, ain't ya? Like me. She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a power. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man. One of the chosen. There we go. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Her faith floods into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania, secure, hidden. I feel you in there, digging around. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true mm. souls gotta look out for one another. Of course. Don't want this rabble interfering with true soul business. Let's go to my chapel. Alright, that's what I wanted. We want the mark. Yeah. Ain't we good enough for the afternoon? All right. Now, my understanding is we'll get her into the room, close the door, and then we boogie. Excuse me. What? Hey, go in. In, Zeno. Do you go? There you go. Okay, Carlac. Go for a good meal. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Okay. Best be on my way. Oi, come here. I ain't quite ready to clear your head. The absolute will protect me. You don't stand a chance. Really? I mean, what's your HP? 40? Now 
this is my happy place. Do I have a number of Might not need it. I probably don't. Ah, oh, that was remarkably easy. Sylvan stone. where I am now. Curse to put my hands on everything. Guys, let's get out. Who is this dude? That the jingle of coin I hear? You've timed it well, my friend. Already turned quite the profit today, so I'm feeling generous. Aw, that's so nice. I recognize the crest she bears, the winged serpent of the Zentarim. Sharp eyes, as then is a normal trader, just a matter of what's for sale. Weapons and other exotic goods. Exotic goods. But most of all, we offer discretion. No judgment, no right and wrong, just good deals and bad. That a problem for you? Bit quieter, if you please. This crowd just burned that into the ground, you might recall. But good. That means Zaris and her little operation weren't found. Seems you're a friend of the family. That warrants a discount. A small one. Okay. What is this? Gold Wormling Staff. Huh. Whoa. This one's cool too. She's got some really great items here. Scale mail.
really like this Monster Slayer Glaive. Let's see here. <sighs> what else? And you don't have any like smoke powder bombs or anything like that, do you? Now you uh, kind of sucks. Say luck. Plus 10. I like that. All right. Next step is we need to probably rescue Volo now, since I am right here. And then I'll rescue. Um, Don't go bothering my pigeon. He's mine. Keep him safe. Listen to him coo. Till I get hungry or some such. What's it to ya? Then catch one on your own. As the symbol glows. Power courses through you. Hmm. Authority. It's going to be plus seven. I was gonna, yeah. Yeah. You don't want to eat sick meat. Take him for a joke, why don't you? And don't let the lads snatch him up. No, tell him what they'll do to him. Bring him back when he's all tuckered out. He's the key. Pigeons all yours. All right, idiot. <laughs> Look at this. I'm quite safe. Yeah. A joy to see a familiar face in such a precarious yeah. setting. I guarantee the story of your daring rescue of my person will live on for eons. You're damn straight it will. 
I intend to do just that. A trusty invisibility potion goes a long way in a place like this. <laughs> we mustn't tarry, but I hate for our friendship to end here. Please, won't you meet me once we've both slipped the goblin yoke? Smashing! Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. Daring do! Slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain! Did that, like, invisibility potion actually look, like, invisible? That's actually really kind of clever. I like that. I need to take care of how am I gonna handle what's her face um, the drow lady Not everybody takes her with the with you but like Really? We want you dead, you dumb knuckle. Not dead any heroic. Get down there and stop complaining. Bummer. All right. A scrying eye. Best not do anything suspicious while it's watching. You see that I want it floating about? Best hope it don't take a fancy to ya. Unless you like playing hide and seek when you're trying to take a damp. Intruders escaped your guards. Dun dun dun. Sorry, mistress. He mucked up. Until their sanctuary is found, I will take something precious from you every hour that passes. A trinket, a tongue, a limb. I ain't no use without my worms. The lads will make the prisoner squeal soon enough. I swear. Silence now, creature. Or I will silence you forever. As she turns to you, her thoughts mingle with yours. A cold hand caressing your brain. The chamber melts away to reveal a dark, endless nowhere. In it, you see a vision. The drow listens as a pale-eyed young woman whispers in her ear. One of those the voice spoke of. One of the chosen. The vision fades away. A true soul? Praise be. Are you here to join my hunt? Hmm. Worshippers of a false god. Their existence is an insult to the Absolute's claim on this region. There is a weapon the Absolute seeks. I'm sure those wretches have it hidden away there. We will find it amongst the dead and the ashes. Her excitement is palpable. 
She lingers on thoughts of victory, of unbelievers' blood spilled, and of the weapon. She will seize it in the Absolute's name. You feel Shadow Heart's anxiety. The weapon the Absolute seeks, it's the artifact that she carries. The same one that protected you as you entered the Goblin camp. Her mind focuses. The cultists cannot discover that the weapon they seek is within their grasp. The thief, whimpering in our dungeon, tried to flee to their sanctuary. We will continue to remove parts of him until he tells us exactly where it is. He's been resilient, but he'll talk. She is seeking the grove you visited. Already you feel her mind closing around yours. So they can warn, yeah. Speak, true soul. The hunt must begin soon. Yeah, because what I'll do is Carlac will be. And how did you yeah. find it? Excellent. Now show it to me. Be my eyes. Her mind enters yours. A splinter of ice piercing your memories. Tiefling faces flicker into view as she attempts to learn the grove's location. Ooh. Do I want to try this? No, because otherwise she's going to be able to uncover it. She sees the entrance anyway. to the grove. As the adventurers retreat inside, joining the tieflings, and then smile serenely as blood and shadow spread like stains across your memory, erasing all that lived there. The cowards found refuge among the desperate. Perfect. If the inhabitants do not realize you have a knife at their throats, we can use that against them. Go to their refuge and make your way inside as a friend. I will gather a raiding party and move into position. You will open the gates from the inside when the time is right to strike. We will cleanse the place of infidels and burn it to the ground in the Absolute's name. And then we will be the first among her favorites. The masterful painting she depicts of the massacre awakens you hungrily. The Absolute brought you here for a reason. To throw open those gates so we can crush our enemies. Good. Marshalling the goblins is no simple matter, but my warband will be ready to attack by next light. You must make your way inside once I am in position. On your signal, we break them. And when they are dead, the Absolute will reward your faith. As will I. For the Absolute. Okay. The prizes for guessing what weapon there are to really is. The artifact. And I could kill her at this point, but I'm actually going to. Whoa, soldier! What did you just do? Listen to me. I'm trusting you, but if you disappoint me. It'll be the last thing you do. Yep. Okay. Now to free Halson. And once I free Halson, then I will uh, kill the Hobgoblin.
And once I do that, then I should be able to take out um, uh, take out take out the druids or take out sorry take out the tieflings at the druid grove. Juicing it up. The beast came in here with those robbers. Killed Dink and Mint too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. And it makes funny noises. We made it squeal. Look, look, you'll see. Give me that rock. I'll show you. What are you? Lost if you can't stand a bit of rough housing. Release me. Get rid of them. Time for blood. Squish. Let's boogie. All right.
Best be on my way. Okay, let's see here. spots do I have? Let's see here. Uh, la 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 la. Over here. Let's find some prey. Really? Can't fire through? Well, that's silly. That's really silly. Oh, that is so silly. Yeah, you come over and see how the grease treats you. If I go here, heading out. Watch you guys clever. Yeah, I really don't need... Nope. 
let's move. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Got this. Slice and dice. We'll do it my way. Goodbye. Moving in. Pardon the viscera. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. <laughs> you aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> A true friend of nature, or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. Yes, but just Halson will suffice. I'm becoming to demand honorifics from the one who saved my hide. Okay. Ah, lunatic then. A jest. I truly am grateful. If only I could repay you. Mm, that look in your eyes. I've seen it before. Are you feeling all right? <sighs> Oak Father, preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The mind flares spawn. But... Something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Perhaps. But I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. Uh, I do that all the time. It has worked out for me just fine. You're after a cure for this parasite. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them, someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for. A way to remove the tadpoles, but I found the, oh, next, the next best, best thing. thing. I found out where they come from. That must be where these enchantments are placed on them, and it's where you'll find your cure. No, this is different, altered. The magic used is beyond me. It's either not of this world or. So ancient as to be lost to even nature's memory. <clears throat> no, excuse me. Indeed, 
After we dealt with the drow that ambushed us, Nettie and I were able to inspect the corpse and the creature that slithered out of it. Slither. I had no idea anyone beyond their ranks was infected. You have my sincere sympathies. I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. I wish I could, but there's still work I've yet to finish. Blood I've yet to spill. I've no right to ask more of you. But if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. It's too late to stop things from here. The goblins are already marching on the grove in force. You must get ahead of them. Muster the defenses. Uh, unless I, uh... you i know it's a great deal to ask but the grove is everything to me hurry then i will meet you there may sylvanus guide us okay Let's gather all of the line breaker boots what is Wrath. Plus one damage. That's yeah. That's that looks like a great item for Gale to. All right. I'll catch a break. Someday I'll catch a break. Evidence chest. Nope. Oh, this must be where... Yeah, this is where they would, uh... Keep you if you, uh... If you were captured somehow. Toy block. Stuff bear. Healing potions are good. Okay. Here goes nothing. Okay. Oh, now to take care of the boss. The big boss. Oops, wrong way. Be 
reading it wrong. Suga no Sukuk. The hobgoblin turns to you, and the parasite squirms in your skull. You taste the ale on his tongue and the bile in his soul. The visions cloud your inner eye for a brief moment once again. You see the hobgoblin bowing before the armored elf you'd glimpsed before. The elf speaks of the hunt for a great weapon and the rewards that will go to whoever finds it. The hobgoblin's eyes gleam hungrily. Gleam hungrily. A lot of hunger today. I hope you guys ate enough. Next words. Yet they still rattle your skull from within. I mean, clearly, it's Thanksgiving. I hope you all ate enough. Now's your chance. This Mind Flayer's build is smaller, its garb plainer. A fearsome creature, even in death. But not the one that tormented you. Yet it too roamed the Nautiloid. It would have seen you, known you. Absolute says the dead Squiddy had a weapon. I reckon the killer nabbed it and scooted off to that looter camp. We find who killed it, and we find who took that weapon. So settle in. You choke on black smoke as the hobgoblin bellows his incantation. Okay. Now is what I used the or why I held off on the Illithid ability for. The hideous corpse rises, tentacles writhing. Your heart seizes, and a questioning the creature might recognize you as its killer. So what I have, uh... Ho ho! Critical success. Take that. Who is the absolute? Who is? Who? You, you're no true soul. Yes, I am. Don't be a dingus. Right. 
can't let her get all of that glory. The raid started already. Let's hope she's in trouble and needs help. You, get to the grove. Help the drow in Thara kill the lot. Well, don't just stand there. Move! I'd rather not. Will guide me. Onward, ever onward. Never a dull moment. How much further can I go? Rivers and streams flow with their blood. Time for some bloody work. Unfriendly fire. The subtle approach. I think I can do it. Yes. Ooh. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, you nasty man, you. Friggin love this positioning. Really, dude? Really? That 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 trick was just silly. My oh, gosh, you willikers! Try it. Yeah. Their 
uses. Blood comes easy these days. Yeah, sure, why not? I'm about to rest. There's a parasite in that corpse, brimming with potent magic. Anything of use? Let's see here. All right, let's gather together. Incredibly successful fight. And now I can actually carry stuff because you know what? I was waiting for the opportunity to use those barrels and by God, so freaking, so freaking worth it. Oh. Did I just level up? Where's the other one? Oh, okay. Swift as my feet can carry me. What should I do? Have to keep going. Let's cut your fire, baby. In position. Oh, I thought you were going for the war drum there for a second. Don't waste a step. Goodbye, buddy. Yeah. All's well that ends. I did get a level up. No, not as bad as it could have. Okay. Okay. Now at this point, we need to skedaddle. Save. Uh, Actually, no. I want to. I want to loot this stuff. I want to loot this stuff. All right, now I am ready. I think. Yeah. All 
Okay. Let's see, Emerald Grove. I might as well level up. Final level up as a true full sorcerer. Let's see here. It's haste. Was my it was between, yeah. I feel like haste is a, very useful. Is there any spell I want to replace? Okay, I found this on the web for spell I want to replace. Check it out. Siri, I didn't ask you anything. <laughs> Stupid. Okay. All right, let's see here. Hopefully. Okay, maybe I need to... Supposed to go. Feel like we're being watched. Do I talk to talk to somebody here? Speak up. Glad you made it inside. That will be safe here for long, though. There will be more coming. Goblins hunting packs. Maybe, but we're not fighters. If they broke through, it'd be a massacre. The sooner we leave for Baldur's Gate, the better. If the road was clear, a ten days walk, maybe? But while the goblins are out there, it might as well be the other side of the world. Okay. Gotta find who I'm supposed to talk to. I think I might need to talk to Zevlor. Hopefully, this conversation will work. Otherwise, I don't know where I'm supposed to talk to. Our time grows short. If Korga won't abandon her madness, then we'll have to try the road. Goblins or no. What is it? God 
gods above. This is wonderful news, but I've seen what goblins do to their captives. <sighs> I wish we could ride to his rescue. But my people would just wind up slaughtered along with him. I'll I'll pray for him. So long as the goblins hold the roads, I'm afraid it's all we can do. Our time grows short. If Korga won't abandon these are civilians. Open battle would be a massacre. Dang it. Okay, so that's <sighs> gotta figure out what I'm supposed to do at this stage. I guess I s try to stand over. Hopefully they close the door. Come on, close the door. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Maybe I'm supposed to rest? I mean, I could try resting. Try it. This setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. I was just settling in and reviewing my latest findings. Mind flares, cultists, and of course, your esteemed company. My esteemed company? Oh <laughs> god, you willikers. Why, I'm practically an expert. They've tentacles, you know. Quite shocking. The druid Halson had some kind of mind flare specimen in a jar in his quarters. A replica, no doubt, but truly fascinating to see up close. I have two. Here, on the Sword Coast. Impossible. That, that can't be. You're mad! But, tell me, have you noticed any residual psionic malaise since the alleged encounter? That's quite impossible. You'd have undergone ceramorphosis by now. I can't attest to the specifics, but I do know that not long after insertion, the host, that's you, turns into a mind flayer. As there's not a tentacle on your head, I can only assume you haven't been infected. If what you say were true, you'd be a mind flayer by now. You? Infected by a mind flayer? <laughs> Ridiculous. Isn't it? Perhaps that's for the best. 
I'd be irresponsible not to debunk such a strange claim. I love how flamboyant he is. I'm a scientist and a poet. And I read books. I write them too. Here in your eye, I could quickly... Oh, dear sweet gods. If we managed it, we'd have a specimen of incredible rarity on our hands. I'll need to research the particulars, however. Give me a bit of time, and I'll have this little issue sorted. His year of benevolence. Okay, that's good if I had a... Uh, good if I had a... Uh, what's it called? Uh, oh, what do you call them? Um, bard. Not this one. Nor this one. And this one are less worthy still. I told you all I was going to do it at level six. Writing the balance. Beyond mortal realms, there doth exist an amalgamation of spirits akin to thine own, ensnared by the treacherous cult of the Absolute, felled in its name. They bear great discontentment with their destiny. I mean, I do too. The pittance of coin. I might summon the worthiest among them to lend aid to thy undertaking. As thou desire. Okay. All right, so I've thought about this, right? What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start with Sorcerer. The cantrips are good, except I'm going to switch to Necrotic Touch there. Spells I'm going with are the same. Uh, I'm actually going to go Draconic Bloodline. And... Let's see, Burning Hands, Grease... Yeah. Ooh, that's great. Then I don't need to worry about the, uh... Okay. Uh, no scales. All right. Now. Now, here's the thing. Um... I am actually going to leave Charisma at 10. I actually don't need to worry about intelligence all that much because, there we go. All right, now. The other class I'm going to go with. Is Monk. All 
All right, next I'm doing Way of the Open Hand. Okay, get my feet. And then I'll go back to Sorcerer for the last. Okay, and this. There we go. All right. Now I have more HP. Um, let's see, it's my armor. AC 16, it's considerably better. Um, should have gone maybe with shield, but you know what? Having magic missile is actually very beneficial. So next level up I get, I'll go with shield or something similar. Um, yeah, and then I have the staff, the staff. Um, plus one bonus to unarmored attack rolls. Unarmed attack rolls and damage. Plus eight, plus nine, yeah. Okay. Okay. Very interesting. Let's talk with Scratch. And then we're probably going to have to take a break for a little bit. You're keeping well, friend. Master. Friend. I stayed with him until... Until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Oh. Best boy ever. Before I do, I'm going to save. Now I'm actually going to take a quick break. Well, for you guys it'll be quick. For me, it's going to be a little longer than quick. But um, I will see you all shortly when I... Oh, very nice. Um, uh, when I come back. We're going to continue this, and we're going to kick ass. And we're back. So let's go ahead. Actually, you know, one thing I want to do before I fully rest. 
check on the old Illithid powers. Just want to see. Hmm. hmm. Passive feature. When you bring a creature down to fewer hit points than your evolved, number of evolved illithid powers, it dies and nearly all, oh it's talk about, yeah, nearly all creatures, uh, all nearby creatures take, yeah, but that would probably hit my allies too, right? I like the idea of force tunnel. Charge forward. Once per short rest. Yeah, I like that. Now, do I want to take Charm? Do I want to take Displace? Or do I want to take Repulsor? I feel like Repulsor can be really powerful. It's the, I'd love to see the, the range on the, the 25. It's just everything within 20 feet gets pushed back. Charm, though, is really good for defense. I kind of like that. There we go. Alright. I want to see if I can also adjust these real quick. There we go. Good. Good, yes. Yeah, these spells aren't going to be great because my constitution. Oh, sorry. No, you know what? Wait, wait. Let's replace what I mean, right? I mean to say, Firebolt and Bone Chill aren't going to be great. Um. But, just because my charisma is not great anymore, my charisma is only 10, but magic missiles, good for hitting multiple targets. Uh, friends, always useful. Um, this guy's self, yeah, all of these, none of these rely. Okay, minor illusion relies on it. So, that's a 50-50 shot. But... Uh, friends, Featherfall, Enhanced Sleep, those don't rely on Charisma. So. Let's see. Reduce the damage from incoming Weapon attack range from a ranged sorry reduce the damage from a ranged weapon attack by one d ten is it oh it's reaction it's gonna be very interesting
Oh, like a spell slot. Okay, I need clearly need to use these bottom buttons more often. Okay, cool beans. Let's, uh, let's go to bed. Perfect. Lots of potatoes. Well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong, or maybe you just get lucky. Oh my. Shit. Yeah. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. Dude, this is exactly what it looks like. I wasn't gonna hurt you. I, I you got your jaws out. You want to kiss me. There in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really oh. is. Oh, you're a vampire. A oh. vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. I feed on animals. Bulls. Deer. Kobolds. Whatever I can get, but it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so weak. Yeah, but then if I just had a little blood, I could think clearer, fight better. Please. Yeah, I did this once. A strange sensation courses through you. And I was not happy with the result. Unfolds. Secrets half revealed. I don't care how much you need, you're not drinking my blood. No. No, of course. Silly of me to even ask. Yeah. I'll go and find something on four legs to eat, I suppose. Don't worry, when we get to the city, it'll be party time. You watch him stalk away, slumped, sulking, and ready to kill. He drooled on me. That's just gross. All right. Stavion, you have some splaining to do. Morning. I hope last night's little unpleasantness Hasn't left a bad taste in your... Well... <laughs> I hope there are no bad feelings. Oh, I have no idea. By rights, I should be cinders in this light, but... Someone or something... Is keeping me alive. Standing in the sun. Wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. That's my theory, but who knows? I'm just glad you're being sensible about these. Yep. Uh, revelations. As long as you don't drink from me, I don't care. People might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. Vamps don't scare me. As long as they keep their teeth to themselves. Carlac. No sense judging someone for who they are. There you go. Except devils, obviously. I'd just better not wake in the night to find fangs at my throat. Oh, 
Uh, quite the opposite. I'm here in the spirit of openness and honesty to work together as a team. Maybe we could get him to wear a bell, dissuade any nighttime prowling. There now. We're all friends again. Well, we're all friends! We you just don't bite your friends. That's okay. I don't even know if I have a very good approval rating or from uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Asterion. I swear to God, if he wants... What is this? Saloon's dream. <laughs> Possibly falls asleep. Uh, yeah, that's kind of crap. Let's talk with Asterion for or Gale first. Ah, I feel like I'm gonna regret this. My condition likes being ignored as little as I do. I must consume another artifact. And soon. Alright, let's see. The problem, I mean, Saloon's Dream heals for so little and has such a bad impact. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't like it. So he can have it. Drink it up, homie. Thank you. Nothing, right? No feeling. Good gods. It hardly has any effect. A mister have mercy on us all. Listen, I need to speak to you, to all of you. It would be unconscionable of me to remain silent. Mm. You're among friends. It might just be I a to remedy that. You have to know who I was. You have to know who I really am. You know, we are about to be at oh, like the goblins are about to attack. Shadow of the promise I once held. Uh... One might call a wizard prodigy. Who from an early age could not only control the weave, but compose it. Much like a musician or a poet. Such was my skill that it oh, earned me the attention of the mother of magic herself. The lady of mysteries. The goddess Mistra. She revealed herself to me and she became my teacher. In time, she became my muse. And later, even my lover. I am, after all, the villain of the tale. Oh, self pity. Each other's company. Body, mind, and soul. But even so, I desired more. You see, no matter how powerful a wizard we mortals can become, we never scratch more than the surface of the weave. Mistra keeps us in check. There are boundaries she doesn't let us cross. Yet, every time I was with her, I stood on the precipice, gazing into the wonders that lay beyond. I sought to cross the boundaries. <sighs> I mean, there's no point in saying, I applaud your ambition. Clearly, he got, you know, screwed over. So. I tried to convince her. I pouted. I pleaded. I swore my ambition was only to serve her better. She only smiled and told me to be contented. Dude, you're like a level whatever mage. You are not, like... Yet I wasn't satisfied. Mistress gifts to, gift to, to Faerun. myself worthy to her instead. Come now to the crux of my folly. Shall I share the story behind it, or would you rather head straight to its sordid finale?
Suffice it to say, I obtained an obscure and ancient book much better. that had locked away inside a much coveted prize. It was a fragment of primal weave locked out of time, locked away from Mistra herself. Uh -oh. What if, I thought, what if, after all this time, I could return this lost part of herself to the goddess? I was certain that this deed of raw power draped in romance would convince Mistra to take me by the hand and welcome me into her hitherto forbidden domains. Mm, oh my. I was mistaken. Nope. I obtained the fabled book and took it into my study. As for what happened next, here, place your hand over my heart. Let me show you. Okay. You feel the tadpole quiver as you realize Gale is letting you up into the dark. You see through Gale's eyes, staring down the corridors of a dread memory. A book bound and suddenly opened. Ow, it hurts! Inside there are no pages, only a swirling mass of blackest weave that pulses. Its teeth, its claws, it's unstoppable as it digs through and becomes part of you. And God says it ever hungry. Thankfully, the moment I absorbed the fragment wasn't enough to kill me outright. It was only the beginning. This netherese blight, this orb, for lack of a better word, is balled up inside my chest. And it needs to be fed. As long as I absorb traces of the weave from potent enough sources, Remains quiet. Were it ever to fully destabilize, however. Rather worse, actually. Oh, joy. I will erupt. I don't know the exact magnitude of the eruption, but given my studies of Netherese magic, I'd say even a fragment as small as the one I carry, it'd level a city the size of Waterdeep. So we can just send that against the Absolute. chance upon a king's collection of magical artifacts around the corner we might cross paths with a miracle around the bend then again we might not all of this it must feel like a betrayal say the word and we'll part ways it's not a betrayal i mean we all got like weird crap that we got going on like i murder people starian's a vampire lazelle is well, lazelle Great relief. Oh, a great relief indeed. You truly are a soul that steals my own. From all my new rallied heart, I thank you. I, I thank you all. will need another item, though. I understand if you stand against me. I'm humbled if you stand with me. Either way, I will do my best not to let you down. I stand at a precipice. But if you do not give up hope, neither shall I. Jesus. I'll fight. I'll resist as long as I can. Okay, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, calm down. My own voice. Let us venture forth. You said it, not me. All right. I should speak up. Ah, my good fellow. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. Okay, sit on the rock. Lay down on the rock. My research turned up a rather brilliant technique that seems quite actionable. It's not too deep. 
just behind the orbital socket. I could attempt an extraction. I've a needle in my tunic, after all. We gonna like sterilize that or <sighs> I'm gonna say do it. I'm gonna save before I do. I'm gonna say do it. You only live once, and I'm not using the acronym. Vola carefully holds one of your eyes open and begins to prod uncertainly with the needle. The needle finds the gap between eyeball and socket. Volo frowns and begins to push. Pain shoots through your body. Ow! The needle snags on your optic nerve. Ow! I think I have it! The needle seesaws back and forth, plucking the nerve like a heart. Oh, God! There's some obstacle in the way. I shall need a more robust implement. Volo carefully withdraws the needle from your eye, then reaching into his bag, he produces an ice pick. I mean, uh, might as well. He slowly brings the ice pick closer to your eye. Now, I, I did don't save. Move. Cold metal presses against the skin beneath your brow. <laughs> oh God! Tap, tap, stab. Oh. I agree. It's a feisty critter. Just. Volo tears the pick from your brain with a violent jerk. Your eye plops down into the mud. Tret. He pauses, looks down at your eye, and recoils slightly as it sinks into the mud. Did I? to be an amount of cosmetic damage. You knocked my bloody eye out. Oh, try not to overexert yourself. You're in a rather fragile state at present. I can't help but feel partly responsible. Perhaps there is something more I can do. What the hell is that? Take this. A far superior relic to that old jelly you were chained to. Try it on for size. And, um, it was very nice to have met you. I'm sure you'll sort out your little brain problem one way or another. What the hell? Far away from here, if you've a heart. Terribly sorry, my friend. Ta. Okay, so I can see invisibility now. Yeah, I can see invisibility. Do I look any different? Can't really. Well, okay. Neat. See invisible creatures, yeah. If only I had that with the, uh, with the hag. All right, anybody else need to talk to me? All right. Now it's time to leave the camp. Wait, wait, bows down. Gods above, we took you for a goblin. Get up here. Uh-oh. I want that gate sealed before they arrive, and we need to talk. Uh-oh. Moving in. Now, don't be mad, but I told them where the camp is to lure them into a false sense of security. And by false sense of security, 
I meant realistic sense of security until I showed up. Then it became abundantly false. Uh, Zevlor is over there. Oops. We need to talk. Well, God's above. You're alive. A little light, just as the day seems darkest. I'd given you up for dead at the goblin camp. I'm damn glad to be wrong. But what happened? We've seen the massing in the woods. The goblins are coming and they're like, yeah, I am going to try to avoid telling him. We were almost ready to leave. Well, there's nothing for it now. A fight it will have to be. We threw them back once. If you're with us, perhaps we can do it again. You're damn right we can. We need to thin the goblin numbers quickly if we're to have any chance of survival. Every ounce of oil that we could spare has been buried out in front of the gate. We'll blow the horn to draw them in and pray our fire arrows strike true. Believe me, I've prayed to find one. But the gods have seen fit to stay out of this. You haven't. And so we place our faith in you instead. See to your preparations and then sound the horn. Let's have this done. Yeah. You've actually fought goblins before, haven't you? So have you, if I'm not mistaken. That wasn't. That's not. All right. Insane. Would you be careful? We're going to spill if you don't stop shaking. Hold still. What's up, homie? There you are, the infernal. Hey! I knew there must be one in the area. If we survive this, let's speak again. I'm a mechanic. We might be of use to one another. I swear to God, if you die, I'm gonna be really irritated that I didn't talk to you sooner. Okay, now, um, let me see if I can, try to talk to like see if what's his face um Housen has returned Ritual stopped. That seems a bit promising. I just realized I could have taken this lever to go all the way back up, but you know, sometimes you think of the right thing and sometimes you don't. Like going all the way around. Oh God, Donnie. Ah, is this a little twerp that's gonna steal from me? Move away. 
Sorry, kiddo. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I guess, uh... I guess how, uh, Housen's not in there. Well, I can't quite think of anything else besides maybe I could talk to this guy. Won't pretend I expected to see you back again. Bloody glad, mind. People are scared. Zevlor's doing what he can, but well, seeing you on the walls might put the steel in their spines. Mine too. Yeah. All right, let's save the game and see how I do. Dink a dink a ding a ding 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 ding. They got spiders, too. I'm gonna jump there and punch you in the face. This is it. Everything turns on this. Bet your bottom dollar you do. All right. Oh, it's me first. I'm guessing we want to pull them in. Definitely want to concentration, concentration, mirror image.
I feel like jumping down there would not be a good idea. So. Season nice one, but, but targets. Ooh, I can throw this when I get the chance. Let's see. I don't think I actually know. You know what? I can't throw it. Where'd it go? Potion of... Oh! Okay. Well, now I know I'm going to punch it in the face. Let's see here. I'm going to hamstring him. As well, move him a little bit closer to this side so he has a uh... step quick. Yeah. What the heck? Oh, that's so cool. Actually, let's do this. Oh, poopy. You're about as useful as a poopy flavored lollipop. Yeah, why not? Yeah, let's uh, move away from the barrel. Or I could take a shot.
All right. Come on forward, buddy. The water's fine. Who are these guys? Oh, there. Now, do I... Hmm... You know what? Blood follows me everywhere. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. How much damage does that do? Yeah, but he hasn't been hurt yet, so... Yeah. No, oh, that was useless. Do I blow up this little guy? On my way. No, I'm gonna let him keep on biting me. Okay, so... Do I blow this guy up down here? Kind of feel like I need to. Open up. Yeah. That's not good. Wait a tick. Oh. Oh, come on, girl. Well, I guess that gate's gonna get opened.
That's all I can do. Ow. Ow. Oh, that's not good. Okay. So. Yummy time. Is that once per short rest? Yeah. No. I'm starting to get tired. This Bollywag. Yeah, he needs to be taken down. Ninety percent. I'm about to say ninety percent. He better go down. On the move. Ow. Um. Only once per short rest, right? No, it doesn't say. All right. I would like to rage. Yeah. And she could just jump on down when she gets the chance. At this point, I think uh, potions of haste might not be a bad call. Oh. That's not good. Okay, first off, Potion of Haste. Where's Potion of Haste? There it is. Potion of Speed. Oh, damn. Come on, dude. 60%. Thank you. Oh, I go far. A shame I can't jump, but
see, is this a path down? Oh, come on, yeah. You're gonna die in here. Really? You're fi you're firing. Oh, no bueno. That's not good. Okay. Well. Wait a tick. Girl. How much HP does she have left? 15? She's dead if that blows up. <sighs> Fight's not going very well. At least I, I feel like it's not going very well. guys only got all right let's find what the best chance I have hell no not that no can't believe it there we go Boy, were there stupid things that you did today. Yeah. Just got feather fall. Yeah, come on in. The water's fine, boys. Yeah, maybe she'll, uh... Wow, she is dodging all of this. Well, partially because they're all so f damn far away. Can I even hit her? She is like perfectly adjusted to like. Trying to get the exact spot 
where she can't just push me over. Good idea, I think. Let's see here. Might regret jumping into combat here, but You pansy. Was vow of enmity. Damn it. If I blow the warhorn again, will everybody be Rallied again? Might as well. I'm not done with you yet. Not enough movement. Yeah. What do you think of that plan? Got it. Yeah, I just killed an ogre in front of you, gentlemen. How do you feel about that? You guys want to tango now? If I jump, that's gonna... Aw, oh, you moved away. I think I won that little duel. We're also going to get out of the grease. Can't slow down. I don't trust you. Goodbye.
you're gone. Really? Like, your drow lady is dead. Your boys, uh, only got, what, two? Three? Four? Oh, you yeah, have four left. See if I can use Revivify on, uh, what's, what's his face? Zevlor. Yep. Oh, target must be a playable character. Poop. Oh. That's crap. That's crap. Where these other goons are? are? They over here? Oh, they're over there. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing to fire at. Yep. Yeah, gotta move your way in. What's going on with me? Vow of M. Lethargic. Hopefully, I'll be okay. Grease is better. Got to press on. Too low. Morally acceptable massacre. For Zevlor. Bashava's black bones. I'm too late. You, where's Zevlor? He died in the fighting. God damn it, Zevlor. I find a clear path to the city. You keep everyone alive long enough to use it. That was the plan. No bloody heroics. But I guess heroics were necessary to survive all this. Who are you? The savior Zevlor mentioned in his last message. Well met. I found a path to the city. And with those goblins dead, 
There'll never be a better time to get on it. But if what Zevlor said of you is true, you have unfinished business out here. Should you be heading west, be careful. This new god has a tight grip on Moonrise Towers, and it was a dark place to begin with. Crap. We've another road to walk, and it's past time we were on it. Though I suppose some thanks is in order. Yeah. Here. It's faint thanks compared to what you've done for us. But it's all we have. My people will join your camp tonight. A farewell, if you'll have us. Yep. Right. Just let me know when you're ready. Okay. So, I am actually rather satisfied with the switcheroo um with the uh, class change I think it's actually rather good <gasps> yes smoke bomb so awesome And, due to one of the mods I have, um, the drow is still alive, so we could potentially recruit her. Spider's Liar. I don't care about that. I'm your Lummox. Yes, you are. Now, stop squirming. What do you think of opening a cart in Baldur's Gate? Oh, Magic, this is junk. Like on the street. Of effort, exactly. No more There's Halson. Yay. Good help you were, buddy. Or are you waiting for the, uh... Waiting for everything, everything to clear up? Oh, you know, I could have just become a bear and helped save, uh... Zevlor, but you know, uh... Well, gosh, you walkers. I can't reach that. That's weird. It's like right there. Whatever. Probably just like one little, uh, what's it called? Morning Star. Yes. Arrow of darkness. Icky arrow of darkness. Okay. Wow. Predicted it like the sunrise. All right. Chop my man health. Grove stands. Nature prevails. And again, I am in your debt. Mm. Speak to Wrath. He will reward you for your efforts. Yeah! Soon, 
First, I must set matters to rights in the Grove. And you should celebrate your victory. After being dormant for so long, your infection is unlikely to produce new symptoms spontaneously. I agree. Tomorrow morning, we shall discuss what is to come. The journey to Moonrise Towers and all the dangers that that entails. Yep. But that's tomorrow's problem. Take some time for yourself tonight. Rest, celebrate. Come morning, I'll be by your side. Woohoo! All right. Let's find Let's find that smith. Might be by his stuff still. Hopefully he is. There he is. Thought I sensed an infernal around here. But you aren't from Eldoro. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the house. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Eltaro. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And... You brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring or leaking oil. Mind if I take a listen? Be my guest. But don't get too close or your eyes will melt shut. Uh oh. Phew. You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together. Tried to house metallurgized demono valves inside a Ragnax alloy casement. Very risky. Yeah, they're devils, though, so, you know, you're not talking about good, uh, good legalized work. What's the, what's the term I'm trying to use? Uh, licensed work. That's the word. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. But help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. Hey, soldier. I think we picked up some of that infernal iron already. What say you? Should I give it to him? Yes. Please let this work. Mm. The weight of it. And that blaze of chaos. Can't imagine this where my heart should be. Must be quite the experience. Give me just a moment. Just hit it a couple times. I don't know much about smithing, but pretty sure it's going to take a few more than just a couple of yeah. iron hit uh, hammer hits you'll have to install it i'm afraid i don't think there are thick enough gloves in all the realms to protect me that kind of heat that feels good i'm still burning hot as hell's hole but i feel less Changeable. Cheers, mate. Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. Could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation, or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Find me again in Baldur's Gate. If I'm worth my salt, I'll have figured something out by then. Take care, Karlak. And hopefully the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. Pocket any infernal iron you find along the way. Hmm? All right. Miss my forge. 
Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Sooner rather than later would be good. I feel like I'm burning serious fuel. Oh, fuck yes. I'm ready to burn all night. Speaking of, I could eat a giant badger. Is it almost time for dinner? Let me talk to him. What's up for discussion? You saved us. I wasn't sure we'd make it through. Yeah. Uh, let me see your wares at least. Better. But this is all I have. All right, let's see here. sell some stuff. Shovel. Okay. May Tamora's luck twist your way. Here we go. Alright. Let's also level everybody up. Okay. Let's chat with uh, Halson and Wrath and all of them. Oh, Kaga. Hanging out in the middle of... Uh, here. This is only the beginning. An army soon crosses the coast. Halsin's cancelled the right. The brood is exposed. And we've you to thank. Sylvanus have pity. Neat. I wasn't sure about you at first. Thought you might be trouble. I was very wrong. I'm glad you were. Seems simple enough. Hey, handsome. You've done it. You've brought House in back. Thank you. You're welcome. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. As am I. The grove will be whole again. And I promised you a reward, didn't I? Let me show you on your map where you can find the cash. Take this rune. You'll need it. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below will be yours. Wow. It's like a bank... It's like a bank robbery that's gone right. You're starting to feel like my personal bodyguard. I wish you were. 
You gnome. Is he a gnome or a dwarf? Alright, let's There's Nettie. I was certain your parasite had taken hold. Wyvern poison. I was wrong. <laughs> Thank you for saving Master Elsie. <laughs> for saving my home. For everything. Huh. Look, I'm sorry. I didn't know what to do when you told me about the tadpole. I don't know if I can ever restore Sylvanus's peace to this place. Is nature all really all that peaceful? Thanks to you. It's all I like. A lot of like lions eating gazelles and diseases go around eating people. Hungry like the wolf. Well, well. What happened here? Don't mind if I do. All right. In the Hidden Vault we are. Secret Societies of the Sword Coast Exposed. Harpers. Shadow Druids. The Order of Clord. Dark Justiciers. <gasps> Wyvern Toxin! Oh, my favorite! More potions of animal speaking. I love it. Animal friendship. Yeah, uh, won't sound healthy than I ask. Sorrow. All right, what is sorrow? Look, I think it's a glaive from last I remember. Sorrow. Sorrowful Lash. 1d3 piercing pulls the target 10 feet closer to you. That's okay, I guess. Robe of Summer. Against resistance to cold damage. Nice. Anything else? Nope, and nope. No traps, please. Ah, you have a manner of Irresistible desperation about you. I like it. Okay, well, got some potions and got a nice glaive. Yeah, okay, I think we're almost... Yeah, I think we're just about ready to... Um, to go back. Go back to camp, anyway.
Head back up this way. Not sure why I'm going all this way. I mean, I'm just gonna go right back to camp. Um, ah, all right. Let's go back to camp. Anybody wanna to talk to me? Anybody at all? Okay. All right, well, we did a whole bunch today. So I think it's only fitting that we kind of wrap up our Thanksgiving Day uh, uh, feast right here. Uh, we'll do all the social interactions post, you know, post our glorious conquest afterwards. Um, thank you all so much for joining me today. I mean, like this is, you guys could have, done all sorts of other things on your Thanksgiving uh, or maybe you know you're watching after Thanksgiving and you're having just a great weekend nice relaxing weekend I hope you guys are getting lots of rest I know you all work hard out there I really appreciate all that you guys do you guys are amazing and uh, if you like what I do if you like what I do um, keep watching my stuff keep watching my videos keep uh, you know uh, supporting the channel and um, I love you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful holiday. I hope you have a very restful weekend. And with that, thank you so much for joining me. Take care and good luck. We're all counting on you.